hello guys welcome back to my channel it is priscilla here again a food and a lifestyle vlogger so today we are going to be making what is called french toast so if you have not subscribed to my channel click on the red subscribe button down below and on the bell sign so as to get a good notification each time i upload a video so i'm going to show you today how i make my french toast so let's quickly get started so for making my french toast i have all these ingredients here first of all i have a leftover french bread look at this bread i bought it yesterday it is a day old so it is very 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 stiff now so i am going to i'm going to reutilize it modify it and make it tasteful so that is the essence of french toast your bread has to be a day old or two day old bread it is not going to be a fresh bread using fresh bread in making toast makes it it makes it saga a bit so this is a day old bread i am going to use this for my french toast so let's get started so guys just like i told you before i am making my own french the way i make my french toast i am just going to show you the way i make my so i am going to pieces this bread into little pieces in this clean bowl so guys i've already pieced the bread into smaller muscle so here is it now I'm going to prepare the egg. I am using five eggs. Putting some vanilla extra. Salt. Some dry fruits. I am going to like I am going to um, soften this dry fruit by putting it in, um, in a hot water because it's dried. So I'm going to put it a little bit in a hot water and then wait for about five minutes before adding it to this mixture. So that is the, that is the dry fruit. I have soaked it for some minutes so i'm going to add it on top of the bread so 
so yeah I'm going to add some sugar you can use brown sugar if you want I don't have brown sugar for now so I am using white sugar so make sure you mix it thoroughly then now we're going to add this mixture to the bread on top of the bread so having done that i'm going to leave it for some for one hour to soak in the i mean the egg mixture i want it to soak in the egg mixture very well and be soft so that is what we're going to do now So now I'm going to leave this for one good hour so that it sucks in the, the liquid. And so I'm going to bring it out to continue with the topping because I have a nice topping for this toast bread. For this French toast, I mean. So guys, here I'm going to start preparing the topping while the the bread mixture is uh, resting for some hour so i'm going to start preparing the topping by this is some all-purpose flour some sugar i'm not going to put it all anyway and then some butter Then you mix together. So guys, we are going to mix it until it looks sandy. Look at that. Sandy like this. So this is the texture you would want for your french toast so that is how i do my french toast that is how i make my french toast added a little bit of salt as well why are we adding salt to all this it's just to bring the test of everything together you need salt in order to make everything united i mean the test so i added salt So that is it guys now the bread has the mixture has stayed for one hour we're going to start topping it and start putting it in the oven so just like i told you i'm going to top it with this so i'm going to start sprinkling it So here it is going to give it that 
crumble test of I mean nature and test so to make it more crumbly I'm going to just sprinkle a little bit of water a little bit of water on top to make it look crumble And then I'm going to sprinkle a little bit of this to decorate it and give it that spring color. Oh my God, giving it a spring color. So now I'm going to pop it into the oven for like about 10, 15 minutes. It's done. So let's check it. Ooh, look at that. Look at that guys, look at this. So that is it, we're going to dish it right now to see how it looks, right? It's still hot. Oh, just look at that look at that look at how nice mm. i'm gonna test it i'm gonna test it look at how moelu it looks look at that mm. yeah mm. It tastes good. It tastes good, guys. It tastes good. I'm some shit. That is it. With this, I come to the end of this tutorial. Yes. So I hope you like this French toast. There is other ways of doing French toast, but mind you, it has to be a leftover bread. A leftover bread and um, or a day old bread uh, we don't use fresh uh, we don't use fresh bread in doing it because it's going to look saga too saga so that is it guys I hope you like this tutorial if you like it do not forget to click on the like button and to share this video so thanks for watching see you on my next vlog Bye bye. So I'm going to eat this. I'm going to drink this with coffee. Some coffee. I'm going to prepare myself some coffee for the French toast. Bye. bye.